So now let's see the advanced screen sharing options that Zoom provides us with. So to access the advanced screen sharing options, I have to click on the screen share icon right over here. And then over here, you can see that the middle tab is advanced. The basic is the ones you use to share your whiteboard, your regular screen here. But in advanced, you get further controls right over here. So the first control you have is to share a position of the screen right over here. So once you click on this and click on share, you can actually select a position of the screen that you can share right over here. So there's a little window as you can see. So only this portion is being shared out right over here just like that. You can resize this out as well as you see right here. And now your viewers will only be able to see this part of a screen right here. So in case you want to share only a part of the, uh, let's say a Microsoft Word document or a browser, then you can actually use this setting so that they cannot see other portion, but just this portion right over here, just like that. And once you want to stop sharing, you can just click on stop sharing right over here. Once you go over here, you can see that now you also have an option to share music or computer audio only. So if you were to choose this option, then what happens is that once you click on share, once you play out any music or anything else, it'll only play that music and it won't share the screen. So you're sharing your computer uh, audio. So whatever audio effect that your computer plays out or you go to um, any music application, it won't show the interface, but it'll only transfer the audio uh, for your viewers. So let me just stop the share right over here. And while you're sharing, like let's say a portion of the screen, you might want to share your computer audio. So you might want to check this out as well, just like this, or you might want to optimize the screen share for video clips as well. So if you're actually sharing a video, then you might want to have this on right over here as well. But in case you want to share your computer audio as well, when you're presenting, then you might want to turn this on as well. The other option you have is content from second camera. So if you have multiple webcams or multiple cameras attached to your computer, then this lets you select that multiple web uh, content as well. So you can click on share right over here. So you can select multiple cameras. In my case, I don't have any multiple cameras, but you can go over here and this one will show you your second camera right over here. And you can switch out the camera right over here between different cameras as you can see. So if you have multiple cameras, you'll have a list just like this as you can see. And then you can choose out different cameras as well. So uh, just like that, you have multiple cameras options. And these are the advanced screen sharing options that Zoom provides us with. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.